What's up, everybody? It's your boy King Hustle. Yes, this is my new YouTube channel. So make sure you subscribe and hit the all notification bell so whenever I drop new sauce, new lessons, new methods, and giveaways, you'll be the first one to be notified. You'll be the first one to know what's going on. And hey, you might be the first one to win something for free. So make sure you subscribe and hit the all notification bell on all the YouTube channels. We're talking this one right here King Hustle. King Hustle Topic. King Hustle X1M. King Hustle 2.0. The Hustle Family. Black Hat Jones. Cook Here Laugh. And Hustle Nation Empire Productions. Also, make sure you follow me on all my social media platforms. All you gotta do is click the title on every video on this channel. Once you click the title, at the bottom of the description, all my social media links will pop up. I got a lot of fake social media platforms out there. I got a lot of fake IG, Snapchat, YouTubes, Telegrams, etc., etc. So what I need y'all to do is to follow me on all my official social media platforms. The first two, um, when you click the, the title, the description, and the links will be my official IGs. King Hustle X1M and King the real King Hustle X1M. It ain't no three S's, it ain't no two M's, it ain't no underscores. So please check the spelling of all these fake pages before y'all get to talking to them and having conversations and sending y'all money. I will not write you. I won't write you saying yo, I won't write you asking you questions, none of that. So if anybody writes you from a King Hustle page, that's a scam page, that is not me. And before we get anything started, this is all educational purposes only. I'm not telling anybody to do anything. So let's get this thing started. So you already know how I get down. You know I'm coming here to drop the gems. You know I'm here to drop the information. You know I'm here to give you guys awareness of what's going on because a lot of people want to make money out there. A lot of people want to elevate their life. A lot of people want to take it to the next level. A lot of people want to do new things. So I'm here to give you guys some information about a lot of different things, and today we're going to be talking about another guy out of San Fran, Fran, Frandino Valley, San Fernando Valley, who was, you know, committing CPM fraud. He made about $3.3 million in credit card loan and real estate fraud scheme using stolen identities, primary children. So today we're going to be talking about that. Today we're going to dive into that. Today we're going to talk about the what, what, like what, what's really going on with these CPNs. How are so many people creating these CPNs and getting so much money? How are people getting rich off CPNs? So like I said, this is all educational purposes only. I'm not telling anybody to do anything but the awareness. These are things that are really going on in the world. I'm not telling a million people to go create CPNs and do this and do that. I'm not telling people to go get credit cards or loans. I'm not telling these people to do anything. These are what they're doing it on their own. And I make these videos for entertainment, for educational, and for people to use it however they want to use it. But I'm not telling anybody to do anything. Some people want to learn how to keep their identity safe. Some people want to learn things for entertainment and be in, just entertained. So... Take that consideration, and let's get into this man that just committed $3.3 million in CPN fraud. A San Bernardino Valley man was sentenced today to 259 months in federal prison for overseeing a long-running $3.3 million credit card loan and real estate fraud scheme using stolen identities, primarily that of children. The scheme involved using credit privacy number CPNs that were used to create synthetic identities with falsified information. Turhan Lamont Armstrong, 50, of Northridge, was sentenced by United States District Judge R. Gary Klausner, who also ordered him to pay $3.3 million in restitution. Judge Klausner also has ordered the, the forfeiture of two homes, one in Northridge and the other in, in Paris, purchased with the elitic funds obtained from the scheme. This is him. At the conclusion of a two-week trial that ended in May 2019, a jury found Armstrong guilty of all 51 counts in a federal grand jury indictment. The indictment included charges of conspiracy to commit financial institute fraud, financial institute fraud, making false statements to financial institutes, conspiracy, conspiracy to commit money laundering, Money laundering, conspiracy, commit access device, credit card fraud, access device fraud, interstate transportation of stolen vehicles, and ag ag aggravated identity theft. Armstrong used stolen identities and social security numbers to obtain credit cards, open bank accounts, and set up shell companies, apply for loans, and purchase homes and cars. Armstrong and his co-defendants for forever use, using the social security numbers of children and people who had left the United States become because they were would be less likely to monitor their credit. 
In addition to using fraudulent obtained credit cards to purchase goods, members of the scheme were able to use point of sale terminals maintained by merchants, which allowed them to make what, what they were essentially cash withdrawals. Armstrong and his co-conspirators also used the fraudulent information to apply for loans from financial institutes across the country. In some instance, Armstrong obtained loans for cars that had already been exported out of the United States. Armstrong did not report any income to the IRS for the years 2009 through 2017, yet he maintained residence in Georgia, Florida, and Sherwood Forest neighborhood of Northridge. When authorities went to Armstrong's apartment in Atlanta in late 2017 to arrest him, to lead to, to the indictment, he invaded the law enforcement only to be arrested three days later, leaving his house in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Investigators executed search warrants at all three of Armstrong's homes, as well as two storage units in Los Angeles area, where they discovered false identity documents, hundreds of credit, credit cards and various names and lists of social security numbers belonging to other people. Armstrong criminal conduct was more than a series of bad decisions. It was a way of life, prosecutors wrote in their sentencing uh, memorial. The victims of the Armstrong's crimes ran a, a government banks, credit cards, issuers, car dealerships, utility companies, and the people all over the country whose identities he stole. The total loss of the victims in this case is $3.3 million, well, $3,305,609, according to the court documents. Co-defendants down there pled guilty in 2018 to charges in this case and were serving federal prison sentences of 51 months and 60 months. So they got a long time. So that's the man about who got 3.3. This is the man 3.3 in uh, CPN scams. So let's talk about it. So let's talk about 3.3 million dollars in CPN scams from car loans home loans, credit cards, and just regular loans, that man was really running it up. That man was really making him some money. And like I said, this is all educational purposes only. I'm not telling anybody to do anything, but it's all about awareness. It's all about knowing what's going on out there in the world, how we can be aware, how we can be 10 steps ahead of getting our identity stolen, getting credit cards in our names and stuff like that. This is all awareness. This is all entertainment for those people who just want to hear new stories and just crazy things that's going on out there in the world. So just be entertained and understand that, hey, people are really out there doing these type of things with CPNs. There are really people out there in the world making millions of dollars off CPNs, just off loans and credit cards and things like that. So I'm going to one to make, be the one to bring it to the front front. I'm going to let you one guys be to know what's going on. So, hey, you can protect yourself and you won't be scammed to have your ID this stolen. So, $3.3 million. And he was mainly using children's identities. That right there is already a red flag. How are you going to be using a kid's, like, I know, I know a lot of people who use children's identities and social security numbers and satanic identities and stuff like that. But like I said, in every case and every story that I present to you guys and I tell you guys, it's always the same thing. They get greedy, they keep going, and they just keep going until they get caught. And like I said, I'm not telling anybody to do anything, but we all got our own way. We No one's perfect. We all got to figure it out our own way. We got to get some money. But I, like I tell everybody, whatever you're doing, I'm, and I don't care what you're doing, if whatever you're doing is making you some money, take that money, invest that money, and keep you enough money so you ain't got to keep doing what you've been doing. Because I know a lot of people out there that's doing a lot of things that they're not supposed to be doing and they don't want to do it, but they just, they're addicted to it. And once you get addicted to it, that's all you know. So you don't know nothing else to do. You don't know what you're going to invest your money in. You don't know what you're going to buy to supply to, to, to give out to, to people out there to, to, to buy from you. All you know is that because that's what's getting you money right now. That's what's keeping you cool right now. That's what's paying your bills right now. But there's so many different things out there in the world that you can invest in and learn that can make you a lot of money and way more money than what you've been doing. And that's what I've been trying to tell you guys from the beginning. Don't get greedy. Nobody's perfect. If you're doing whatever you're doing and you know it's wrong, get in and get out. And you see, he, he, he got in 
It made him $3.3 million, but now he got to pay $3.3 million back. But I, but this just the catch. He got 21 years in prison. So he can't pay that 21, that until 20, after 21 years, he going to get out of prison when he's about 71 years old. Once he get out, he got to pay $3.3 million back in restitution. How is he going to do that? How how, how, how how does he think he's going to do that? Who thinks he's going to do that? Who thinks they're going to get their money back? So I'm telling people, like, listen, if something works, come up with a game plan to make it make sense with anything that you're doing out there in the world. Because nothing is forever. But as long as you continue to learn and grow, you can create longevity and you can continue to stay afloat and, you know, be in the people's eye. There's so many ways to make money out there. There's so many ways to make $5,000 fast. There's so many ways to make $10,000 fast. There's so many ways to make a million dollars fast. It's just about how bad do you want it? Because if you wanted it bad enough, you'll go do whatever you needed to do to go make it happen and get it. Point blank period. I don't care about none of that. Just like how a crackhead won't crack so bad, so they're going to do whatever they got to do to get that crack. If you wanted money so bad, you'll do whatever you needed to do to get that, to get that dollar. You'll do whatever it took for you to get a million dollars or whatever you need. Me, I, I'm doing whatever it takes for me to get 10 plus million dollars. Building my brand, continue to push out content, continue to put out more music, more skits, more blogs, more videos, more movies, all that. So you, you guys can love the brand. I shoot movies, I mean, I shoot music videos, and I'm the artist. I do it all. I make beats, and I get beats from people. Because at the end of the day, people need beats, people need videos. If, hey, if this ain't nobody trying to get a song from me, I'm going to shoot your video. If you want a video and a verse from me, we're going to work something out. I'm going to make it make sense. I'm going to get the dollar. A lot of people don't know how to make the dollar. You got to make it make sense. Learn how to get the dollar, and once you learn how to make the dollar, a lot of things will change. And like I've been telling you guys from the beginning, you got to change your ways. Once you make a change, change will come to your life, point blank, period. If you wake up every morning or you wake up every day at 2 o'clock in the afternoon, start waking up at 8 o'clock in the morning. Now watch how, more t how much more time you got to make some money and think about it. Watch my videos and figure out what are you going to do? What are you going to sell? What are you going to learn to do? To, to give to the next person. And now you just sold something for a $1,000 10 times and made you a quick $10,000 all profit because of the knowledge that you... So that's the story of the $3.3 million CPN man who got 21 years in federal prison. So make sure y'all tap it in. Make sure y'all running them views up on these videos. Make sure y'all come to get y'all lessons. Basic lessons is $800. Unlimited gems is $1,500. And book your seat right now for the crypto tour in Houston, Texas, $4,500. $500 deposit. $4,000 a person. And like I said, you're going to get everything that you need to know to get ahead. Documents, CBNs, uh, ethical, unethical hacking, uh, the, the mega book. You're going to get all that. And I'm going to teach you how to do it hands on. I'm going to help you out. So make sure you tap in. Book your seat right now on the Crypto Tour. Shout out to all my Real Hustle Nation Empire fans. Shout out to all my Real Hustle Nation Empire supporters. And shout out to all my Real Hustle Nation Empire Family members, because without y'all, none of this would be possible. None of this would be possible for real. I wouldn't even be going. I wouldn't keep, continue to make these videos. So, I'm going to continue to grow. I'm going to continue to make these videos. I'm going to start making skits and mini movies for y'all. So, this entertainment going to kick it up a notch. I'm going to start acting and doing some fun stuff for y'all. Dropping more music and music videos. So, I make sure y'all go follow King Hustle 2.0 and King Hustle X1M right now on YouTube. Subscribe, hit the all notification bell. Then go follow King Hustle X1M and the real King Hustle X1M on IG. The links are in the bio. Once you do that to so all four, Send me them screenshots, and then I might got something for you. Might got a free method. I do got a free method for you. So you see this video, and you see what I'm talking about, and you watch this video through the whole thing. Thank you, because now I got something for you. So make sure y'all go tap in when we come get y'all lessons, come get these gems. And y'all already know how I get down at the end of these videos. Peace. See y'all next video.